the back end of last year and I just do wonder Jesus if that has first. not quite sorted itself out yet he did have some treatment but uh, James Wilson has only managed to win one match so far this season that was around an hour 85. ago against Ricky Evans it went 6-5 it was a much improved performance because going into this his uh, three 57 previous performances had resulted in a t tour average of just 79.86 and that is far 30 from the standard that we expect from a man of James Wilson's means in fact it's so bad that it puts him third bottom 60 of the tournament average or the tour average for all of the players who had competed before today and there was 131 of those 100 Up against the young Dutchman, Neil Zonnevelt, who's 40. fared slightly better this year, although he has had a couple of first-round exits. He's beaten Adam Huckvale this afternoon, and he got to the board final last Sunday at Players' Championship 2 in Barnsley 50. when he enjoyed impressive victories against Madaz Razma and Christoph Ratajski before losing out to Mickey Mansell, who was in particularly 140. good form that day. Bring you up to date with some of the latest results at the end of this leg. 60. I can tell you there has been a, a big shock. One of the big names going out in the second round. I will let the suspense run for a few more seconds before I reveal the name of which one. Zonnevelt looks to break immediately here. Eighty-one choice of treble here might be the nineteens, might be the fifteens. Was the fifteens that leaves fifty-four? But he's missed the big number. Twenty-nine. It was uh, a seemingly casual. Well, he does have a kind of casual-looking lob, doesn't he? Neil's on a veil, but it's allowed James Wilson an opportunity to try and bend one around that into the bull. 48 and he couldn't quite bend it like Beckham there game shot Zonnevel takes advantage uh, I'm not sure if he's got a nickname yet Neil Zonnevel but I did suggest zigzag last year I think it goes with his throwing style kind of zigzags his arm in the in the air making a Z shape anyway back to the 60 results coming through and I can confirm that Rob Cross has been knocked out in the second round a disappointing weekend for Voltage sparked out by Carol Sedlacek 6-5 Joe Cullen has followed suit by the inform Mike Kivenhoven who's enjoyed a, a fabulous start to the season a 6-4 success for Kivenhoven That's Zonnevelt's Dutch compatriot, who did next to nothing last year. 80. But has made a quarter-final already on the Pro Tour in 2020 and has beaten the likes of Brend uh, Mensa Suljevic. He lost to Brendo Dolan in that quarter-final, but he's 96. beaten Mensa Suljevic, Adrian Lewis, and now today Ryan Joyce and Joe Cullen. Sullivich, incidentally, safely through to the third 100. round. A 6-5 win for him against Steve Lennon. Lewis also through. He's beaten Luke Woodhouse 6-5. Yesterday's winner, Ryan 50. Searle, is through. A 6-4 win for him against Chris Doby. Searle still on for the double. And a reminder, if you haven't been watching here 52. all afternoon... Michael Van Gerwen has produced the performance of the day, beating Ryan Murray 6-2 with an average of 110. Well, 111 almost, in fact. 48. James Wilson not threatening that kind of figure here. And not threatening the 154 checkout, but he is 98. going to leave it fairly handy.
140. Pressure applied. Game shot. But Wilson has managed to cancel out that breaker throw immediately. That Rob Cross defeat, by the way, significant for viewers here on Stream 2 because we were due to have Rob Cross, should he have won. It means we'll be getting the first check to a card holder instead, Carol Sedlark check against either Jose de Sousa or Luke Humphreys. Ninety-five. Eighty-five. Ninety-seven. We'll keep trying to bring you results as we get them. As we watch the action unfold here between Wilson and Zonnevelt. 96. The three highest recorded averages so far today. 104.5 by Christoph Ratajski, 107.6 by Ian White in the first round, and then that 110.9 that I mentioned from Van Gerwen. This pair in the 70s at the moment. 140. Sometimes it's not how you play, it's who you play. 6 78 Double top 33 Well neither player looking likely really here And James Wilson in particular needs to use his experience to see this as, a, as an opportunity decides to split now double one four scored but he hasn't managed to hold on to his throw after firing in 18 darts and Zonnevel if he can find double top with one of these three game shot which he does makes it a third consecutive break in this match Well, I have to call it as I see 83. it, and it has been scrappy so far. We have seen some stunning stuff on this stream. One hundred and forty. And maybe James Wilson is going to spark into life. The best performance we've seen here on stream two 100. is that of Darius Labanowskis in dispatching of Michael Smith with a six-two win. One hundred. This is much more 46. neat and tidy from Wilson, who's returned to his Jammy Dodger nickname, having been dubbed as a lethal biscuit for a couple of years. Ninety-seven. I've just seen that Kim Hybrex has won the Belgian derby, 6-5 against 40. Dimitri Vandenberg. No need for Wilson to take this out, but he might fancy getting himself going. Is it the bull or does he lay up? 116. He's gone for the bull. Sometimes that is the reason when you're not playing that well, it just gives you the confidence, doesn't it? If you can take out a big finish. 115. Well, that is a terrible dart from Wilson, but he looked to put it right. 
game and shot. That's nicely done because that dart in the seven could have been obscuring his sight of the double sixteen. But he's starting to raise his game a little bit here. 140. A match that has seen four breaks on the bounce. Could be about who holds their throw first. This one. 45. One hundred. Much, much better in the last couple of legs. 60. At least the way he started the legs, James Wilson. Nice and straight, nice and tight. One hundred. And once again, after nine darts, he's on a finish. 140 99 95 So treble 10 will be the first port of call, and now double 16, pinned it in the last Game leg, shot. pins it in this one, and finally a player manages to defend their throw successfully. 100 and credit where it's due because as I mentioned James Wilson had been playing at a, a very poor standard not just in the start of this match but in the start of this season 100 and to have lifted himself over the last couple of legs is very admirable and he might well manage to play himself into some kind of form 140 who knows if he could go on a, a run today It'll be Glenn Durrant in the third round if he manages to get three more legs here. 180. Sonneveld trying to stop him in his tracks with the aid of a maximum. 83. Well, that's a poor visit and Wilson has every opportunity to pile some pressure on here. 58. Rectified somewhat. Game shot. Totally rectified by Neil Zonnevelt. Who ties up this second round match at three apiece? 100. The pair sort of following each other. Four breaks and then two holds. Neil Sonnevelt just 21 years of age. 55. The winner on the development tour two years ago. One hundred and eighty. Second year on the tour, having won his tour card outright on the first day of last year's qualifying school, the European qualifying 58. school. Fifty eight. Twenty two. Well, that was not what was required from Wilson to back up a, a maximum. But he has got plenty of room to manoeuvre in this 140. leg. 
99. Tidies it up to leave a two darter. Well, this would be an expertly timed match. 125. And the deflection has left him on a much harder out than he would have left. Even if he just found the single 20. May matter not anyway. As Wilson eyes up double 10. 80. Well, that's disappointing that. The margin is massive. And it allows the chance for Zonneveld to pick his pockets, which he has on the ball. Well, where has that come from? James Wilson had a 180 in that leg. He missed two darts to complete a 100 checkout. 100. And then saw his opponent sneak up on the blind side and take out one, two, three. One hundred. James Wilson has thrown first four times in this match and three times has seen that 60. throw broken. Ninety one. Just had word that Gary Anderson has booked his place in the third round. 137. Saturday success for the Flying Scotsman last weekend. Could it be Sunday this weekend when Anderson wins? He's averaged 101 in a 6 1 win against Jonathan Worsley. 100. Alan Tabern has enjoyed a, a notable 100. success 6 5 against John Henderson despite averaging 10 points less. And the Highlander in that match. One hundred and forty-five. Neil Zonneveld might be about to put himself at the point of no return. Still on ninety-six left. Double eighteen. Sixty-eight. Well, he made Wilson pay in the previous leg. Can James return the favour? He's earned himself two darts at tops. Game shot. And this time he's on the mark and in the money. And this topsy-turvy affair continues because that is another break of throw in this match. The sixth we've had in just eight legs. 60. One hundred and forty. One hundred. One hundred. Next up here will be Evil Charlie, Carol Sedlarczyk, against either Jose de Sousa or Luke Humphreys. That match is currently 4-3 in Humphreys' favour. 100. Five. That made that 4-4. De Sousa has levelled it up. Might be a break of five minutes or so after this one if that one goes down to the wire. Looks like this one will go down to the wire. 59. Neil Zonneveld eyes up yet another break of throw here. 
But he stayed there because he liked the lie. 93. But he does not like that. Don't mind that when you think that you need to take it out. Why not take advantage of a, a good marker? But Wilson looking at top to hold his throw for just a second 62. time in the match, and it hasn't happened. And the 13 may be unlucky for James Wilson. He's only just managed to put that in the one, and he's, he's done the right thing here, I think, by stepping back, just to recompose himself. Certainly on the floor with no crowd behind. They'd all be making a right racket now, wouldn't they, on a big stage? Ten. But It didn't work out in the end. It didn't look like very assured attempts. And when it comes to the crunch, well, a split. Game shot. Wilson kept his cool, showed his experience. Eighty-one. It won't always work that way, but it did then. If you don't opt to split second dart, of course, you're giving yourself... One hundred. ...potentially the maximum opportunities. I do get it with the odd number. So had he missed the five inside, he wouldn't have had a third dart at double. One hundred and forty. he missed it outside and you do get the maximum opportunities, but as it was, Wilson had a plan and he executed that plan. 180. One hundred and twenty-five. Well, the moments of this ma moments of magic in this match have been few and far between, but Wilson has offered up a maximum 100. And two tons either side as he hopes to seal the deal here and now. Could be denied. Oh, that was millimetres away from finding the treble 19 he was aiming for. 70. But now the Jammy Dodger has the chance to seal the deal in style. Treble 17. Would have earned him a dart at the button. Well, he's missed the big number there. And again, that has been a hindrance for both players. A bad trait 49. for both of them. Just a lack of composure at crucial times. And it could be a repeat of the previous leg where... Zonneveld has failed to hold his nerve and the experienced hand of James Wilson does find the big segment and he beds Game the ball and, the match. and there it is, a 6-4 success for Wilson who moves into the third round for the first time this year Early in the match he struggled, but he managed to lift his game and take advantage towards the end. Just having a little debrief with the match official there, James Wilson. But he's a happy man to move through to the third round, and we'll be back with some third round action in around five or ten minutes.